Hi there, Internet. I'm Polar the Polar Bear, and this is my girlfriend, Melissa. Hello! Welcome to, we haven't filmed one of these in a while, welcome to another episode of Barely Edible, courtesy of uh, Kristen and her father. Thank you, guys! Oh my god, yeah. And I keep seeing Kristen comment on our Instagram that she would like us to film more Barely Edible, and I just want to say that I'm officially disowning her. <laughs> and her father now. I'm okay filming more. We got, we have a bag. We throw up. I don't know if you introduced yourself. I said I'm Polar the Polar oh, Bear. Oh, did you say it's me? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, that happened. It's we, It's been a hard week for it's her. It's been a rough week. She's, um, her brain's a little blasted. That's why we didn't yes. post a video Which I'll explain. Friday. We're filming out of order, but we're going to post a micro bear tomorrow, and I will explain at the beginning of that, you know. So if you're it, curious, yeah. watch that video. Um, she probably won't get fully into it because it's a pretty lengthy story, but... But I'll explain a little. A little bit, Enough yeah. that you know why we didn't post. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Um, so today we are trying Sil Dill Herring and Dill Marinade from oh. Ikea. I don't think... Um, I don't think it's cooked, which is what concerns... I hate... No, it's gotta be. I hate fish of any kind and uncooked fish, like, even worse, you know? Marinated skinless fillets of herring. Yeah, it says they're marinated. It doesn't say anywhere that they've been cooked. Well, for safety, I would imagine they're cooked. Yeah, people eat raw fish all the time, though. Maybe the mar maybe it's like ceviche where the like. I think the, I the think the acid cooks it. Isn't Sweden the company that the company? <laughs> <laughs> the company Sweden. There's probably a company named Sweden somewhere. Isn't Sweden the country that gave us Sir Stroming, which is literally just like fish fermented in a can it could so be bad Norway. that sometimes the can explodes and it smells like like literally people will throw up just smelling it. That could be Norway. That it could, could be. be. Norway. Norway, bro. Um, I got a Lenny scratch. If I keep looking down, it's because I'm making sure we're still in frame because we yes. are trying a new filming angle. Yeah, so. we completely rearranged the bedroom, so we're actually yeah. at a desk right now, which we normally used to film on a bed. Which is so. nice, because we have space for all of our stuff, and yes. we're facing the window, which should give, We've like, got natural light natural coming light. in. So, we're hoping this will be, this will work, so. Hopefully. Uh, but I'm just keep checking to make sure we're not, like, shifting unconsciously out of frame. So. so I guess you have to, I can't open it, I'm too weak. So, Kristen and her father got um, this at Ikea. We don't know how no. much it is, if and. If you guys remember, <laughs> you can comment. Um, nutrition in Info will be in the description down oh my below. God. We have a barf bag which we need to open. You, you want to open our barf bag? Yeah. I just oh 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 it has like a film on top. Oh. God. I wonder if I can show. I don't think I can really show that to you guys very well, but that's that's the film on top there. It's like yeah. it's just dill. It's not like mold or anything, no, it's just dill, but... Uh, full disclosure, I'm not trying a full piece of that. Um, I will say it actually doesn't smell bad. If you want me to eat a full piece of that, you can come over here and make me, <laughs> internet. If, if you want us to eat a full <laughs> piece of that, uh, donate to Patreon <laughs> extensively. Yeah, that's the thing, like, we have the Patreon set up, we don't really plug it, I don't think half the people know it exists, but yeah, if you I, want I, us to eat something weird, and you would like to fund that weird item, you're more than welcome to. We're not trying to make like money to live off of but um, <laughs> i'm trying to make i'd well, love to do this well, full we would time love to, but i mean realistically <laughs> then we would never miss a posting date because <laughs> i would stay up until midnight if i had to to get that post done i mean realistically though this is just kind of for fun but if there's ever anything you want us to try that is like weird or or like zebra know, balls you or... can reach out to us and we can figure out a way for you to send it to us we're happy to try whatever you want um I yeah. will say it doesn't smell too bad. I'm afraid to smell it. Uh, smell it. It smells just like dill. It smells I know it's like, kind of stuffy, which is probably good. It smells like a pickle. Oh, it does. Yeah. I hate dill, for the record. Uh, I, I like dill pickles, but I don't like dill, and that smells like dill. I like dill. Um, I'm good with dill. We have our dainty little forks to take awful bites. All right, so... Do you want to try it one at a time? Maybe kind of use the lid as like a drip catcher. Sure. It's drippy. You go first. You want me to go first? Yeah. You. Oh, don't use that fork. That fork apparently is dirty. Oh no, so. it's mine. I used it to scoop. Uh, oh, okay. Scoop something. I use it to scoop the hot pocket out of the package. All right. That's why I took it because it's I licked it, so oh, <laughs> I didn't want to give you my licked fork. What well, we made out? I don't care if. Yeah, we have. <laughs> don't care if Wink. your mouth is in my mouth. That's fine. Yeah, I'm not. I, I'm gonna try the smallest piece I can find because I don't like like I don't want to barf today if I can help it. We I haven't. Uh, uh, how about we split this piece? 
can you cut it in half? Oh, yeah. you got a drip on the mouse pad. Ah! Uh, we have ah! to burn the house down now. Sorry, guys. <laughs> BRB, we need to burn our apartment down. Oh. oh my god, it looks... I think I see scales. No, it said it's skinless. Oh, I don't even want Oh wanna... god, it's really hard to cut through. It's chewy. Oh! It's either chewy or there are fucking fish bones in it. <gasps> you shut your mouth. Oh man, I just said that. Well, this, hey, there's your profanity warning. Oh my god, I can't even cut through it. Oh, it's so gross. It has the consistency of raw fish. I'm telling you, I think it's raw fish. I think Lenny oh thinks god. it's raw fish too because he's trying to get up here. It's so gristly. Do you want the piece I sort of um, macerated or? Uh, honestly, I'm just like because I I suspect that there are bones in it, so I am not gonna swallow a whole piece of that. I'm gonna take it in my oh, mouth. Oh, I will. Fish bones aren't that bad. Tiny fish bones are fine. I'm gonna take it in my mouth, oh my chew it, and spit it out. Like it, seriously, guys, as someone who doesn't know, it just it's mostly descaled. See. It's mostly descaled. As someone who has tried raw fish before, um, this has the consistency of raw fish. It I, is, I it told you. Some, it has some texture to it. It's raw fish. Um, oh my god. Okay. I, I gotta pretend like it's good. I promise I'm not swallowing that. Like, there's no way in hell I will swallow I'll that. I'll swallow it. Um, like, a lot of cultures, like, especially like in Asia, where they eat fish, like, whole, and they, they serve you, like, a whole oh, fish. Oh, yeah, no, I've seen... Like, people eat little fish bones, and they're fine. I've seen, like, people eat, uh, it's like a squid, and they just dry it and, like, run it under a, a steamroller, and then they feed it to people. Okay. I've seen the horror... I'm just sort of letting the juice drip off of it and stalling, because uh, I don't want to eat this. Put it in your mouth. I'm trying to tell myself I'm hungry because I haven't eaten anything. I am hungry. I am. I am hungry too, but I'm not hungry for no, raw dill fish. No, but I'm trying to be like, fish. this is food. You're hungry. It's food. You're hungry and it's food. I'm so terrified to try this. Um, God, this piece feels really big. Is it too big? Get out of my way. Oh, it's like... Your piece is tinier! Trade me! Oh, no, it has a thing hanging off of it! No, oh, you gotta take that. That's a booger or something. No, it's just fish. Remember, I had to cut it with my fork. Oh, it's like a snot booger. Take it. Show the camera. It's gonna drip. You like you like that, audience? It's gonna drip. Oh. Oh, I don't wanna... All right, before it, uh... Before it goes bad? There it is. That's what hers looks like. Mine looks worse. Hers looks like a Oops. decent enough piece of fish. I, it's because I cut yours with my fork. Oh. It didn't look like that when I pulled it out. It doesn't look so, or it doesn't smell so bad. Oh, I still see scales. Little scales. I just, oh god, you have to know that I hate the texture of raw fish. I'm like, going in. Okay, you go first. while he's barking. <coughs> oh. I apologize for my beard right now. Oh. I know you're getting a closer, like, shot of us, too, so... Oh, God. <laughs> His barking is making me sicker than the fish. <coughs> oh. I chewed that for only a couple of seconds. Was the texture like it was raw? Yes. Oh. It's not the texture. <coughs> it's the taste. The taste is that bad? Yes. Lenny is very <coughs> perplexed. Hi, Lenny. Oh my god. You don't want this fish, cat. <coughs> <laughs> we might edit some of this barfing. Oh, oh. oh God. Oh. Lenny would probably like. <coughs> oh, God. Oh. Here, love. Oh. 
<coughs> Why can't I stop barfing? Why can't I stop barfing? I didn't even swallow any. <laughs> Let me. Oh, God. Oh, sweet God. Oh, Jesus, why? Your beard. Oh, I know. Okay. I, I got know. more if you need it. Oh, yeah, I need it. <laughs> more, please. More paper towels. Oh. Well, there you go. If you were looking for a... Well, I see no no point in me trying it now. We obviously Oh, oh, oh no, you... Tr oh, man. <laughs> I, like, got mucus all over my shirt. Go, go wash it. Yeah, we gotta wash that now. Yeah, in future videos, the rest of the videos we're filming today, people are gonna be like, why is there crap all over your shirt? <laughs> it's because I puked. Should I, I'm gonna cut my piece in half. You know, you're not, I, I, I'll tell you now, you're not gonna swallow, oh, I got barf on my hands. You're not gonna swallow it. So, I don't know if you really need to bother to, uh... I'm just gonna cut it. Alright, you can cut it if you want to. Yeah. It tastes like bad fish. Like, like raw fish that's gone a little bad, and awful tartar sauce. Like, spoiled tartar sauce. That is the taste I got, and that is why I barfed, like, immediately. I was like, I thought with the smell, oh my god, I'm disgusting. I thought with the smell, like, oh, it doesn't smell bad, maybe I can do this just fine. And then I bit into it, and the texture is, like, boogery and alien. And then, like, the taste of just bad tartar sauce and, uh, and, like, off fish. Probably not off, it's probably just raw, and mankind wasn't meant to eat raw fish, so that's why. Oh. That is impossible to cut through with the fork. I, you just gotta go for it. Like, I just went, I was, like, terrified, so I just went for it. Oh man, the battery's draining really quickly. We're gonna need to plug in, I think. Okay, we can do that. But, uh, in the meantime... <sighs> okay. I, I just went for it. That was my secret. I just Tiny put Tiny piece! Just put it, you gotta chew it, too. You can't just swallow it with your nose closed. Ugh. There is still, like, mucus in my beard. Oh, yeah. You want me to count you down? That helps me. I just me. don't wanna do it. The countdown helps me. Oh my god, seriously, this is the worst! <laughs> yeah, that was bad. I mean, I had to, like, drinking the clam juice, that was bad. This is, I've been through, I've been through worse! No, the clam juice was better than this. The clam juice was like a, a lemonade on a hot summer's day. What about sake? Like, is there anything that's been as bad as this? Um... I feel like if we try pig's feet, it'll be pretty bad. Pig's feet, I bet, would be worse, but that we've tried, not taste-wise. I, I think I hated the Dave's more because of the heat, like the ultimate insanity sauce, but this, taste-wise, I think is the worst thing we've tried on this show. What about in your life? Well, I, I once I once uh, put a piece of chocolate in cream of mushroom soup and tried to eat it, so... He was a kid. It I've, like I've yesterday. Done, yeah, no, this wasn't, like, <laughs> this week. I was, like, six, but, yeah, that was pretty bad. But, no, this is, uh, in recent memory, definitely the worst thing. I apologize for my disgusting shirt and vomit bar. I'm psyching myself out for it. I need to stop. Okay. Uh, it's, just, it's delicious. You should try some. Looking outside... It's really beautiful. I spit it out because I'm not worthy of how There's tasty it is. There's a beautiful tree out there, and once it's done, it's done. I just yep, gotta do you it. you just gotta do it, and then and it's... life's thrown worse at me. It's know? over. It's gonna be okay. All right, all right. Three, two, one. My hands are sweaty! Down. Do it. Go. Oh. <laughs> it's actually, it actually is not as bad as I thought it was going to be. You know how I am with fish, so that's why my reaction was intensive. <laughs> the texture wasn't chewy. Oh, the flavor in my mouth is bad, though. Oh, can you see the liquid ah! at the bottom of that? That's my bar. Oh, it's in my teeth. <laughs> okay, I gotta talk not breathing through my nose for the rest of this episode. The texture is not as chewy as I thought it would be. <laughs> it actually tastes like a really sweet, 
if not kind of spoiled relish. I, right, spoiled. Like, it tastes like it's gone off. It tastes like it's a bad relish. But, but that being said, it's not the grossest thing I've eaten. What's the, what's the worst thing? Clam juice. Oh, those sardines. Oh, yeah, the sardines were bad. But it is in my teeth, and I can t taste it every time I bring my nose. Um, yeah. So should well, we rate I mean, it? <laughs> it's a big fat zero for me. Uh, I couldn't even, like, I didn't even get it down before I vomited, so that's a definite zero on my end. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how, I don't even know if I grew up eating this, if I could eat it. You know, I, people, people do, especially in those, like, Scandinavian countries with the, like, like, pickled and fermented fish. And I know, again, in, like, a lot of Asian countries, people will just, like, you'll just be, they'll walk along and, like, they'll peek in the ocean go, like, oh, a fish, and just pick it out and stuff the whole thing in their mouth, so... That's a common practice. You know, the flavor in my mouth is kind of like I've been eating relish. I get, like, tartar sauce yeah. taste. It's not, it's, it's actually less bad than I thought it would be. The aftertaste actually is not bad. And even the taste, it was gross. But what I was telling myself as I was tasting it was, it's it's not fish, it's relish. As soon as I made the connection to relish, I was like, I'm just eating relish. I'm just eating relish. I'm just eating relish. And you got through on that. Uh... It's really gross, though. Obviously, I would never eat that again. Uh, and just because it was better than I thought it would be, it's still disgusting. Yeah, so. that was nasty. Yeah. So I would give that... Uh, we had someone walking by, so I didn't want to be like... It would be um, really loud. But we... Yeah, I'd give that a zero. That's a zero. It's yep. a zero. Double zero. I don't recommend it. Um, no. I don't recommend, I don't recommend it. it. Like, I would eat an entire <laughs> jar of like Marmite and Vegemite before I would eat that again. I don't know about that. Not at once, but like... <laughs> like over the course yeah. of time. I could spread it thinly on toast with some butter or something. I think I'd be okay. Uh, or some of my teeth, though. Um, so I yeah. think if you eat that stuff how it's supposed to be eaten, it's probably fine. Honestly, this stuff, I imagine people probably put it on like toast or crackers or... That stuff? No, I think people's, people eat that like neat out of the jar. Really? I think so, yeah. I could be... I'm not Swedish, so I could be wrong. Yeah, it does kind of just show it in a bowl with a fork. Right? I like, know. here, put this, eat this instead of cereal in the morning. <laughs> it's not as bad as I thought it would be, but it's still really gross. So, yeah, I just, I don't recommend it. And, I mean, on a barely edible, you got some puking. So, that's kind of what yeah. you're looking for in these, I think, right? Um, and you always have had the weaker stomach <laughs> than me, so. I, it depends on the thing. Yeah. Like, I can do spice a lot better than you, and you can do raw fish a lot better. I can, yeah, like, in the barely edibles, though, I think you puke more than me, but, like. I do. Yeah. I do. But, like, there are certain things that just, like, make me gag immediately, so we all have our things, I guess, but. Yeah, there are. Oh, jeez. <laughs> So, yeah, I guess we'll end this and move on to a drink that can wash the flavor out yes, of our mouths. Yes, please. I need some Bing Crisp. All right. Thank you for joining us <laughs> on this awful, awful Barely Edible, and we hope to see you all again very, very soon. Bye, guys.